Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Ryan's Corner. Uh, I know I'm not on screen at the moment. This is a video that I've kind of just put together out of the blue. Um, I should have my little character on screen. This uh, character was made by my friend Zara Lockett. Look her up. Uh, some great fucking designs over there guys. But uh, I'm doing this video because Lego today announced something pretty big. I was in the middle of recording a couple of videos to get myself backlogged. And then I looked and Lego have revealed officially revealed the lego star wars ucs republic gunship and um, this is set number 75309 it's going to have 3292 pieces and of course it'll be in the 18s plus range and it's going to be retailing for 350 euro or dollars like this is a big big set guys this is one that the fans have been waiting for for a while yeah guys this was fan voted i think it was last year they voted for this they wanted the republic gunship a lot of hype around the set guys and we we're expecting a reveal of this at lego con and now they're only revealing it now so it's a bit strange but it, who cares we've got the reveal now guys and this set looks phenomenal it is huge it is absolutely huge we got the box art here guys the box art looks great the ucs packaging which i love the side box art guys returning here for lego star wars ucs packaging is always great to see it comes with two mini figures guys which is pretty disappointing it comes with mace windu which is a great figure to get and it also comes with a clone trooper commander which everyone wanted commander cody but we're getting these two mini figures which is such a disappointing and uh, minifigure count for a set of this magnitude for $350 you expect a couple of more minifigures but I understand it's not for the minifigures it is a display set but still I would have liked to have seen a kind of a rarer minifigure a more desirable minifigure to be thrown in here rather than Mace Windu but I, I'd love a Mace Windu minifigure and yeah guys just the sheer size of this thing guys he's absolutely massive i wasn't expecting it to look quite as big as this well with the piece count and stuff like that but still i didn't expect it to look this big he looks fantastic i'm probably going to give this set a pass guys not because i don't want it i absolutely do this is a set that i'd absolutely love to have but it's nearly double the price of my most expensive lego set that i've ever purchased so for that reason i'm gonna give it a pass maybe sometime in the future maybe if i save up or if it comes on sale or something which lego sets don't often do especially on the lego store but this is a set that is gonna please a lot of people it's exactly what we wanted it is a fantastic looking set and just showing a bit of love to the prequels as well guys which we don't often get so that's really great to see and even though i'm not a massive fan of the prequel trilogy guys there is some iconic builds in there guys and some iconic ships in there so and none more prominent than the republic gunship itself guys so this is going to be a fantastic addition to anyone's star wars collection this set will be launching on august 1st guys coinciding with all the other star wars reveals coming out um which i should be picking up some of them guys but i don't think i'm going to pick this one up um anyway other than that guys this is a fantastic looking build i'm excited to see what it's going to look like in person with other reviews and stuff guys so check it out guys and um, thank you guys for tuning into this episode i know this is a pretty random video and uh, let me know if you kind of like these style of videos i might do more in the future and until next time guys uh, stay safe out there